I was shocked. I think it's just ignorance. The outrage is over this, a Snapchat. It's a photo of the Loyola Marymount University Christmas tree and young school kids visiting it. But it's the caption, those words that have shaken the feelings of some on this campus. Quote, just me and all of my peers. Oh, wait. Those are lower socioeconomic minority students that LMU buses in for tours and uses affirmative action to get them in later. We were speechless. Student after student during this finals week LMU told us they knew about the Snapchat. This, this is Snapchat when it came out. Did it kind of like just spread like wildfire across the campus? Oh, yeah, for sure. Um, yeah, there was a lot of like pretty much everyone's Snapchat story that I checked. Everyone was like furious about it. It has been absolutely heartbreaking to see that you're with your peers who would think of this. And um, it's just, I mean, it's not shocking to see that in conditions or times like these, this sort of polarizing opinions. This is the second time in two years that there's been a controversy on this campus over things that were written. Last year, it was anti-immigrant sentiment scrawled on walls, now the more electronic version. Ironic because students told me the day the Christmas tree went up, it was a happy thing. Lots of people, great diversity. I do think that someone would say this? That was shocked because that's not the general LMU attitude. It's just disappointing, you know? It's just an absolute disrespect. LMU officials declined our invitation to appear on camera, but they issued this statement that said it remains unclear who originally authored the reprehensible comments via Snapchat. The sentiments do not represent the LMU community nor our values. We condemn this type of speech and will continue to ensure LMU remains a safe and welcoming environment for all. And listening to some of the students who go here, that's exactly how they feel. At LMU, Hal Eisner, Fox 11 News.